Hey guys, today I'll be showing you a rapid piston pulse generator design that I came up with. Now before we get started, I don't claim to have come up with it first and I'm sure there are similar designs out there. Before we get started on the pulse generator, there's just one basic concept you have to understand and that is that a block can send power through to the other side. So this redstone torch is powering this wire and this repeater is being powered by the wire. So this repeater sends power through this block to the other side which activates this wire. Now if I press this button, as you can see, this wire depowers. Without this block here, this wire can't receive power. This stays on, but the wire does not. As you can see, this is how it works. It's sending a constant signal to this wire and this wire. So how do you build it? Well, it's pretty simple. First off, place a redstone torch down. Place a repeater in front of that. Run a wire alongside of that. Grab your piston. Place it on this side and two blocks apart, place another piston on the opposite side. Then you run a wire from here, place your redstone uh, <laughs> repeater down there. You'll need a block for this part here. And you'll need to run your wire up the block. If you didn't have the block there, this piston will not be powered. For this side, you just place a repeater down here run the wire along the side of it and into the piston and that's it, you're done now one thing to keep in mind there is a way to increase the speed somewhat if you place a wire here, but we'll get to that later so place down your block and as you can see you've got a constant signal now one thing you'll need to do if you want to be able to manually control it is run a wire from where the um, torch was to a block you can have this as far away as you like as long as you keep the signal up with repeaters and whatnot and then you can place a lever down and as you can see you can control it so I'll give you a quick demonstration of what I mean by using both signals to send as fast a pulse as you can and we'll use a note block to show this so switch it on and as you can see pretty quick pulse if I break just one of these sides the pulse slows down now you can use the method I, I mentioned earlier and place a redstone wire there now you've got one signal this one will be slightly slower but well now that the rain's over <laughs> this will be slightly slower this one will send uh, a pretty quick pulse through to this note block and I'll demonstrate it As you can tell, a quick pulse. And as I said, it's, it's slightly quicker than the other side. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment if you like the video, if you want to see more tutorials like this. And leave a like if you like the video.